just not the one now. So it is ridiculously dark outside today. It has been raining all day. The boys just got home from school. Uh, and before we get started, how was your day at school? It was good. 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 Yeah. good. Did you get in trouble? No. You don't sound so sure, Micah. What happened? No. Okay. <laughs> Y'all see he ain't even looking at the camera. I didn't get in trouble, but I did help the brother out. You helped the brother out? Yeah. What? <laughs> you gave him my pretzel goldfish. You gave him your pretzel goldfish? Yeah. What happened? He didn't have snack? He did not have snack. So you shared? Yeah. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> okay, let me stop. <laughs> <laughs> so we are here with our August 2017 Vegan Cut Snack Box. Yes. <laughs> this box is loaded. And we got some chips right on top. So, mm, y'all want to start on these? Chips. Yeah, let's start on <laughs> Let's start off some chips. Why not? Come on, Mama. You forgot the, you forgot the information card. Slow down, Mama. <laughs> okay. <laughs> y'all getting too grown. I'm the information card keeper. Yes. And I will explain whatever in order to make an information card of life. The information card of life. Of no. life still. It's still of life. Yeah, I don't it think will, it's oh, life anymore. It will, it, you don't it think will, it's life anymore? I don't, I don't, I don't think it will it's kind of like life. the information card of life. I, I think we shouldn't call that anymore. I think it should be handsome Micah. Handsome Micah card? What? <laughs> that don't okay, make sense. I'm reading the handsome okay. Micah card. Uh, no, we're not calling it that. We need to regroup. Item number one is a bag of chips from a company called Deep River Snacks. And these are called Honchos. Honchos Organic Ranch Flavored Chips. So what does the card say, Gabe? It says... Look at you. You don't put the card underneath the, underneath the chair. So it's not flying everywhere. <laughs> what does it say? Deep River Snacks. Organic Seasoned Tortilla Chips in a Top Notch Ranch. Maybe. It kind of sounds like Cool Ranch Doritos. Do you think it's going to be like that? Yeah. Something like that? I think Gabe is not a good fan of Rancho. Yeah. Yeah. Picky yeah. Gabe, y'all know how he is. Y'all know how he is. Oh, so they're kind of like thicker chips. Oh, they smell. Look at me already. They smell like kind of like a cool ranch type of chip. A little bit heartier, if that makes sense. Mine so, is always getting like some of the perfect examples. I know. Look at mine all curved. Look at mine. It has no head. Oh. <laughs> Right, I think we all agree for once. For once, we all agree. I'll put this up. 
feel like they were really good. I like popcorn. Not as much as mommy does. But I like <laughs> popcorn. And that popcorn was definitely really good. <laughs> so, yeah, they don't taste like butter or anything. They just literally just taste like plain popcorn with sea salt. And I think that they are really good. I wasn't sure because they, I thought they were going to be a little bit plain to be honest. But yeah. perfect amount of salt, perfect amount of and pop. They <laughs> so don't have anything else in it, just sea salt. Yeah, and oil. oil. That's it. What do you think, Mike? So I think they're really good. Mm -hmm. Really plain. Same thing as mom. Is plain good for you? Um, vitamin and salt. Um... They're really good. I think it's a healthier choice than other popcorn. Yeah. Yeah, like cheese so, popcorn. Cheese, cheddar, a lot of butter. Yeah. So these are from the company Enjoy Life, and these are soft baked minis. Snickerdoodle cookies. They look like this. What is snickerdoodle? I don't know. Oh my god. I don't know. It's a type of cookie. What is eating? A type of flavor. I don't know y'all. Let us know what Snickerdoodle is in the comments. Enjoy life foods. Dairy free. Soft baked. Soft baked. Mini Snickerdoodle cookies. The word Snickerdoodle. Did you say dairy free? Yeah, dairy free. Dairy free? That's awesome. Okay. Snickerdoodle is kind of like a funny word to me. So it's like yeah. Snickerdoodle. I'm like Snicker a doodle on the what? What? <laughs> <laughs> yes. So I'm excited because these are dairy free and um. A couple of the other cookies that we love, like home free treats. Yeah. Oh my gosh, those cookies are absolutely amazing. We buy them all the time on Amazon, and they're also dairy free. So this should be interesting to try these from Enjoy Smell Life. Cinnamon. Cin cinnamon. Oh yeah, they do. They're really cinnamon. What? You're gonna stretch your little arm all the way over here? Maybe Snickerdoodle, some kind of. They smell really cinnamon. 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 All right, all right, you already know. I can't say cinnamon. Cute too. Really cute. but there's a lot of pasta in here and this cooks up very well so this is the organic true roots gluten-free ancient grain pasta panic what is going on my phone but yes this is delicious all right so up next we have some peanuts okay this is from a company called pizzo oats pizzots pizzoots probably pizzoots yeah. and it says flavor infused Premium Virginia Artisan Peanuts in the flavor Baja Taco. Baja. Um, I've never heard of. I never heard of Baja. Flavored peanuts, to be honest, really. Yeah. <laughs> so oh, what do you say? Oh, peas roots. <laughs> Premium artesian peanuts infused with Baja Taco flavors. This will be a first for all of us because I don't think we've ever tasted flavored peanuts before. I know we've had pizza almonds before, but yeah. not taco peanuts. <laughs> so. Did he take a, a picture of all of these? No, I didn't. I forgot. I forgot. So, okay, so now we're going to have open items for the pictures. So we apologize, y'all, but I usually take Sorry. the pictures um, ahead of time, but we totally forgot. No, how a taco beef? <laughs> the thing that I put in taco is like peanuts. meat. It's because of peanut butter. Taco meat? It's like peanut butter. It looks like a taste of peanut butter. Gabe. They're just peanutty in the beginning. Mm 
with tits of peanuts, and then just the taco. It's it's like spicy weirdness. I'm like weirdness. It's, it's, it's like spicy. It's a spicy peanuts. I'm like seriously, like no joke. They taste like peanuts that have been infused with taco seasoning, like taco flavored like seasoning that you would get, like old El Paso seasoning. That's what it tastes like. They're not like terrible or anything They're like that. Terrible. It's just. I think I just re prefer to have either a peanut or a taco, not like put together. It kind of tastes like meat, like taco beef maybe. Um, what I taste is just like a little bit of cheese. A little bit of cheese? It tastes up to, it tastes like a scent of that. A scent of cheese? Like it has an essence like, of cheese? Yeah, like, oh, okay. it tastes like cheese. Maybe you just want tacos for dinner. Mm. <laughs> so looking at the box, we have a couple things in here that we can taste. Um, but I don't know how much time we have left on this card. So we should have time for at least two more. So up next is another nut. These are almonds, which is like my current favorite nut, I think. Um, I'm right pretty now. sure it's my, mine too. You like almonds too? I really like almonds. You like cashews too. Cashews, almonds. Mm -hmm. Peanuts? Me, me? Just not taco peanuts? <laughs> not taco peanuts, but maybe regular peanuts maybe? Maybe. Okay, what about you, Gabe? I do not like almonds. I, like I, I, I don't like cashews. I don't like, I don't like nuts, period. Okay, well, let's see if you like these almonds. So this is from a company called Babalu Nuts. And it says, out of the shell almonds seasoned with tajin? Tajin? Tajin. Tajin? Okay, so I'm kind of like worried that these are going to be really spicy. These are going to be really spicy, y'all. Get y'all water together. Okay? <laughs> Babalu Nuts. Almonds topped with chilies, lime juice, and sea salt. Lime juice? Lime juice? I don't know. These are going to be interesting. It might be sweet and spicy and salty. Ooh, I that, don't know. That's not really a combination. <laughs> that's... Once again, I'm going to try not to destroy the packaging. Let's just do one of these. Just in case they're really, really spicy. Why y'all leave me with the big one? <laughs> y'all left me with the big one. Because you like almonds. I do. You like almonds so much. They don't really smell like... You know, I can smell lime juice. I can smell a little bit of lime juice at the like the very end of the scent. I can smell lime. Yeah. Yeah, I can smell lime too. Oh! Did y'all taste it yet? No. Did you taste it yet? I tasted a piece of spiciness. Okay, sorry. That literally just burned my tongue. And I freaked out. Sorry, did I scare y'all? <laughs> It hit the tip of my tongue and it like immediately like kind of stung a little bit. Alright, three, two, one, bam! Bam. Again! Hey. <laughs> I don't like nuts! He don't like nuts. Not surprised. So what did you like about these? I feel like it's just uh, spicy almonds, chili peppers, I didn't really taste the salt. I tasted a lot of lime juice. I smelled a lot of lime juice, so it definitely I did put a lot of lime juice in there. Uh -huh. I think I barely taste the salt. Really, a lot of lime juice. Yes, a lot of lime. A lot of lime juice. Spiciness is barely hot for me. Barely hot? Barely. So for me, y'all saw me like freak out. I literally freaked out. For some reason, it like if I lick it like that, <laughs> it burns the tip of my tongue. But when I ate it, like when I went for it. It didn't do that. So I don't know what it is. Maybe like, I don't know. Maybe my tongue just sensitive right now. Okay. Yeah, Whatever y'all. Okay. Maybe I don't you know. You can't handle like hot, hot things. I can't handle spicy foods, Mike. What you talking about? <laughs> In the end, surprisingly, they're not bad. Right, so we only have time for one more. Um, so it's a toss up between the Go Raw sprouted watermelon seeds or the popped chickpea toes, baked green pea and chickpea puff, caramel and sea salt flavored. Chips or puffs. So which one y'all want to go with? I'll go with the watermelon seeds. Yeah, the watermelon seeds. You guys want to try the watermelon seeds? Not to mention, y'all are not even like huge fans of watermelon. I'm sorry. Let's question that. I am a big fan of watermelon. Since when? Every time I buy watermelon, you're like, I don't like watermelon. I'm sorry, I never say that. What? Yeah, uh, okay. I never say also that. Like watermelon. You don't ever say that? But okay, I the next time I buy watermelon, let's see if you eat it. I, 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 I,
like, rotten. I haven't eaten it in forever because I like pineapples more than overall. Sprouted organic watermelon seeds with the hint of sea salt. There's, there's a lot of sea salt stuff. A lot of sea salt, yeah. salted sea salt kind of food. Yeah, they don't really smell like anything. You gotta smell like air. But they look cute. They look like little teardrops. <laughs> Bam! Double strike. Oh. Alright, so what do you. I'm surprised you gave it a five, Gabe. I mean, because they're, they're not bad, but like. I just didn't. I just, this, this, it tastes like seed. It <laughs> I mean, it's, it tastes like sea, it's the sea, but it's not bad. <laughs> that bright sea salt, but it's, I just feel like it didn't have a lot of flavor. It just like, it had yeah, sea salt, it was just like, bitter. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> All right. All right, Mike, what do you think? The reason why I put it up like this is because that, it does not just taste like sea, <laughs> it does not just taste like sea. It does not taste like that. In the beginning, <laughs> it tastes regular. And at the end, it tastes like, kind of like a, I don't know how to say it. Okay, so are you thinking sunflower seeds? Kind of to me, it kind of reminds me of sunflower seeds, and I love sunflower seeds. Um, so this could be like an alternative to that. Um, but yeah, I think that they're good. Yeah. They are just, they're kind of plain, but like they're. Sneaky. <laughs> I think they just remind me of sunflower seeds. That's so. true now. <laughs> we can show you what we haven't tasted in the box. Yeah. Yes. So now we gotta pick a winner for this box. Yeah, the winner. You got your top two? Yeah, I got my top two. Alright, what's your top two, Mike? So my top two is the ranch chips. The honchos? Honchos? The honchos. Mm -hmm. And the little soft baked cookies. Oh, okay. What about you? My top two are the cookies first okay. and the popcorn second. Oh, the wise popcorn and the snickerdoodle cookies from Enjoy Life. Yep. Okay, so my top two are the snickerdoodle cookies and the honchos ranch chips. So, do we have a winner? Yeah, no, we, we do. Some winner, so Drum roll, please. Uh, the winner is the Snickerdoodle Cookies. <laughs> the Enjoy Life Soft Fake Mini Snickerdoodle Cookies. They are delicious. So before we go, we also wanted to let everybody know that this will be our final vegan cut snack box for a while. Yeah. Um, only for a while. Yeah, only hopefully for only while. for a, a while. The boys just went back to school, and our schedule is just absolutely jam-packed. They're going after-school activities and everything like that. So, yeah, we're going to have to take a little bit of a break from unboxing our vegan cut snack boxes. But hopefully, we're still able to post um, snack reviews of things that we find, like, while we're out shopping and stuff like that. Because we yeah. still love doing, like, reviews and still love, like, taste testing and stuff. Um, it's just we're on kind of like a time restraint right now so i think we've gotten a lot braver over the yeah. past year with trying different brands and trying different foods and stuff yeah so it's, yeah it's been a lot of help yeah. for us and we are now making like healthier choices and everything like that too so, so unboxing vegan cuts has definitely helped our family out so. we hope you enjoy the taste test videos that we've done mm -hmm. and i'm pretty sure y'all You'll see them all in the future. Yes. <laughs> so like Mike said, we really enjoyed making these videos and unboxing these mm -hmm. boxes. The snacks were really good. And we just appreciate it. Yeah. Very much. Thanks, Megan Cuts. Okay, we love y'all. Yes. Yes. Um, <laughs> Alright, so we hope you enjoyed watching today. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more videos and hit the bell to receive notifications of all the videos that we post here on the channel. Take care. Peace. Peace. <laughs> Be sure to check out my channel homepage and our new channel, The Wind Down with Chris and Ty, for lots more to watch.